let you shine like you grew up in the shrine in Peru. From the city of brotherly love at Citizens Bank Park, the show presents the National League Division Series. It's the New York Mets taking on the Philadelphia Phillies. First pitch coming your way next. Ready to go now. And the batter will be the shortstop, Francisco Lindor. Hard ground ball based now. So a man on base to start the inning. Everything came together perfectly for him right there. He wasn't able to elevate it, but he put a great swing on it. Right on time, good balanced approach, and just blasted it through the infield. And now it's Mark Vientos. Nobody out, runner at first. Bows that off to the left, and we'll do it again. It's outside. Two and two. Lindor on the move. The other way. And there's a hit. And now runners at the corners. Nobody out. That is good. The center Here's Brandon Nimmo. Brandon Nimmo. Yeah, that's outside. Now two balls and a strike. Good spot for the hitter. Definitely has the advantage in this count with runners on. Look for him to be aggressive on this next pitch. And that one is inside. Grounded to third. Could be two. Over to start for one. They complete the double play with a run scores. It's 1 0. Here's Pete Alonso. That misses. Two balls and a strike. I think it's huge that they were able to score right away. You're playing on the road. Stakes are high. Energy in the ballpark. And you help to quiet that down a little bit. Swings and misses, and that will end the inning. And we're back. Stepping in, Kyle Schwarber. That one way outside, and a count two and one. Cuts and misses, it's a strikeout. Here's Turner now. And another ball. The Mets leading by a run here in game two. Right through there for a strike. Three ball. Two strike. So no, Turner reaches base. And this is a guy with good speed. So man aboard. Bryce Harper to the plate. One down. Phillies down a run. Swings and misses. Struck him out. Here's Nicholas Castellanos. Two and one. Pitch out, but no action. The Phillies trailing by a run here in game two of the NLDS. Hey. And now two and two. And a swing and a miss. 
That ends the frame. at Citizens Bank Park, all set for the start of the inning. And stepping in for New York, number 11. On the ground, right side, stop. In plenty of time to first, one up, one down. Here's Jesse Winker. The left Jesse. The 1-1. One -one. To the right side. Stott over to first in time. Two up, two down on the top of the second. Two outs, base is empty. Here's Starling Marte. This to third, and that chance handled. Tosses to first. Marte retired. And the Mets go one, two, three. Obviously a guy who makes good contact, hits for average, but one of the things in today's game, the value in the fact that he hits both righties and lefties. Severino kicks deals. Foul ball left side, he'll see another. They're so reliant on the matchups nowadays, Chris, and it's huge when you don't have to sit a guy or platoon him. When you can hit you know, both sides in terms of pitcher's arms, you're a guy that it's hard to take out of the lineup, and I think it's very important today when everything is under the microscope. Hacks and misses, it's a strikeout. This is Bryson Stott. Still two and two after the foul ball. And the right-hander deals. Swings and misses. Couldn't catch up to the heater. JT Real Muto steps in. Severino. Swings through that one for strike two. Home team down a run. Bottom half of inning number two. Headed down the line. Taylor ranging after it. He's got it, and that'll end the inning. And welcome back to the ballpark. And now it's going to be Tyrone Taylor. Legends really are cemented in the postseason. You think of David Ortiz heroics for the Red Sox, Derek Jeter as Mr. November, or Randy Johnson in the 2001 World Series, just to name a few. And a foul ball. Well, on that idea of postseason reputations, Boo, got to mention players like Carlton Fisk, Reggie Jackson, and Madison Bumgarner. We were lays out but he can't squeeze it still able to get it there in time and that's out number one on a tough play next to hit Francisco Alvarez three two line drive Man, that's one of those at-bats where you have to remind yourself it's about the process. He did everything right right there. Nothing to show for it. But in your mind, you have to convince yourself that it was a very good at-bat. Yeah, there's a ball. Next pitch is in the dirt. Ball three. Here's a swing and a drive left field, and he knew it. A gigantic blast. And they add a run. It's 2-0. Mark Vientos up now for the Mets. And here it comes. And a big swing and a miss. Two down, nobody on. Ground ball, left side. Boom, goes on to first, and that is the inning. Back here, 
Citizens Bank Park. Brandon Marsh steps to the plate. Right-hander kicks, deals. That's the ball. And a foul ball. Kicks and fires. Swing and a fly ball in the air out towards right center field. Puts it away for the out. One away. And digging in for Philadelphia, Johan Rojas. The Mets leading by two here in the last half of the third. And now two balls and a strike. Got the back going too soon at strike two. One down, base is empty. Foul ball, another 2-2 upcoming. And another ball. And it's ball four. He missed down low. Oh, do you think you could draw a walk in the bigs if we gave you no, another bats? Oh, that's a good question. Um, I think that if they gave the pitcher a full scouting report on me, yes, I think I could draw a walk. And a pitch out, but nothing going on. Rojas leads off first with one away. Swings through that one. Well, that's today's style of baseball right there, right? Big time velo on the bump and big time pop at the plate. There's a swing and a drive. Out of here. He flexes his power with that swing and it ties it up. It's 2-2. Two -two. Base is empty one away. Here's Trey Turner. Good eye right there. Tied up here in the early going. That one ripped. And he one hops the wall. Around second is Turner. The relay to third. In there safely. Well, that was one of those high percentage advantage counts where batting averages are just so much higher. Good pitch hard and inside, but he showed off some quick hands, got the barrel to it, and was able to yank it into the... Oh, no! He dropped it. But plenty of time to recover. And that's the second. Nick Castellanos at the plate now. Two outs. That one pushed foul. And a pitch. Chop back up the middle. Lindor. Whips it to first. That ends the inning. second game of this division series and now the center fielder Brandon Nimmo the wide to kick the pitch swing and a foul straight back well after scoring runs this is where you're looking for that shutdown inning get that hot team back in there to swing the bats the one two line drive makes the catch and there's one gone and now it's the polar bear, Pete Alonso. It's never fun going back to the dugout after hitting a line drive that finds a glove, but you will get some high fives. You know, when you make great contact, you feel like you've done everything right. But in this game of baseball, not everything is in your control. And now it's even up. Two strikes to a guy who's already 0 for 1 with the punch out. The only guy in the lineup with that strikeout. But you can't get too relaxed. You still got to make good pitches to get him out. Swings and misses. It's a strikeout. Couldn't hit the fastball at the knees. Here's the third baseman. It's interesting he plays kind of a, a power spot defensively, but runs pretty well. So when you're looking at that position, you're not expecting someone that has maybe above average speed, but he does. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And that is that. Back 
here in Philadelphia. Bottom of the fourth. And now for the Phillies, Alec Ball. And a pitch. Swing and a line drive curling foul down the right side. Ripped on a line. Taylor makes the grab one away. So digging in now for Philadelphia, Bryson Stop. It was all over that fastball right there. I tell you what, if he gets under it just by a fraction of an inch or a little bit more, that's way back. The pitch. Swing and a ball lifted in the air. Shallow left field. Makes the catch. Two down. It's important. If he can go one, two, three here, it would be a very positive sign for him and for his team. Here's a one-one. In the air, out towards left center, sizing this one up. Makes the grab, and that's the inning. Ready now for the fifth inning. Here's the left fielder, Jesse Winker. And a pitch. Swing and a ground ball up the middle. That's a base hit. Man aboard on the leadoff single. Now that designated hit. Starling Marte up to hit. Marte. At the belt and fires. That's the ball. Two balls, one straight. Runner on the goal. And that one fouled off. Winker gets his lead at first. Nobody out. Double play ball to second. Off balance feed. There's one. And two. In time to first for the double play. And next for the Mets, Tyrone Taylor. Check swing, no appeal. The Mets down by a run. And we're at the top of the fifth. On the ground. And oh. foul ball. Swing and a miss, and he chases that one in the dirt. In time, the 2 3 strikeout ends the inning. left fielder Brandon Marsh pitch fought off foul that misses and the count is two and two it's a good take bounce to third and that one handled gets it to first and that's the first out in the bottom of the fifth Johan Rojas getting ready to hit. One down, base is empty. On the ground to the left. Two up, two down. Back to the top of the lineup. Kyle Schwarber comes up to hit here. Swing and a miss, and that's that. Top six. Now, Francisco Alvarez. Francisco Alvarez. The one one. Right side, hard hit. Harper takes it to the bag. Now one gone in the top of the sixth. 
So the lineup flips over. Now up to hit Francisco Lindor. Comes up empty. That's strike two. This is the time you have to pull out every trick in your bag. They know the season is over with the loss. Things are looking great right now, but they're still in striking distance. They need to get something going real soon. Now the number two hitter, Mark Vientos. And there's a rocket into the outfield. Makes the turn and heads for second. The throw in. Not going to no, get him. He's in there. Now that. The center field. So digging Brandon. in, Brandon Nimmo. Left hand hitter waits. To third. Boom. Whips it across. And that is the inning. Welcome back to the ballpark. And now, Trey Turner. That clips the zone, and the count is one and two. Just missed. Really good take, especially with two strikes. Riding to the plate. Line drive, base hit right for you. And the leadoff man aboard. Well, patience and discipline no, paid off right there three. as he got into an advantage right. count. Nice job of driving that pitch right. the other way on a line. You know, hitters, they take so many reps in the cages right. working on going to the opposite field, and it doesn't always translate into the game, but right there it did, and he did it. And now the right fielder, Nick Castellanos. Turner, the base runner at first with one out. Turner runs. Swing and a miss. Save the second with a stolen base. And he fast. It's so fun to watch. Bows it off, still one and two. The pitch. Out to short, Lindor. Tosses across the first, and Castellanos is out. Good arm side run to that same side hitter right there. Very difficult to put that ball in the air or get through it. Just pours in on the hands. Here's a 2-1 that one down the line and that's just foul next offering upstairs okay. runner at second two down here in the bottom of the sixth swing and a miss struck him out inning over Getting started and stepping in for New York, Pete Alonso. The first base, Pete Alonso. Looking to get the tying run on base. Close no. one, doesn't get the call. And that's ball two. The line of the pitch. Sharp grounder, that's through for a base hit. Off to a good start with a leadoff down. Well, that was an important at bat in this now game, so a great First job there. Step out of the bullpen for the Phillies, Carlos Estevez. These are the spots where relievers really make a name for themselves. Late and close. There's not much margin for error, but at the same time, there's a reason they're put in these situations. No outs, runner at first. Now the third baseman. Yeah, that one missed. And yeah, there's ball four. Base knock and now a free pass. This has the makings of a big inning if they can get a couple more quality at bats. Jesse Winker up now for the Mets. With the tying run at second, go ahead, run at first. Here in the late stages of game two. That's ripped into the outfield. Brings it in. Runner tags at second. 
Safe. He beats it. Good read there at second base to move up to third. Now it's a lot easier to get that run in with one away. Now it's the DH. Starling Marte. Foul back our way, and that's out of play. Well, all eyes on the double play ball in this spot. No better way to get out of this inning. Got it! Huge strikeout there. So up next for New York, Tyrone Taylor. Tyrone Taylor. Two on, two outs. Swing and a miss. And the count, one and two. A lot of times you'll see a pitcher maybe double up on a pitch. This guy will throw it three times, four times in a row because hitters just can't lay off of it. Bounced out to short. They get the force. Third out, and that ends the frame. We're back in a new pitcher here to start the bottom of the seventh. Sean Manaya. Bringing in the lefty with the left-handed hitter coming up to hit. Classic bullpen move right here, so we'll see how it works out. Bryson Stock digs in now. Take it high in the draft. He's had that top prospect label over him since he put on a professional uniform. But at some point, that starts to go away, and you've got to produce at the big league level. Bounced up the middle. Whips it to first on the run. And they get the leadoff hitter in the seventh. And up to the plate is JT Real Muto. And that one fouled off. One and two here. Fights it off. He'll see another. Base is empty, one away. Here at the bottom of the seventh. Gets a piece there. We'll do it again. One down, base is empty. And another ball. Well, now that this is a bullpen game, it's clear that whichever bullpen steps up the most is likely going to come away with the W. That pitch just misses the inside corner, and now it's three and two. And now the lefty. Swing and a high fly ball, pretty well struck right field. That's back, and it's out of here. And they add a run. It's four two. So one out, nobody on. And digging in for Philadelphia, Brandon Marsh. There's a swing and a miss. One and two. The wind of the pitch. Line drive. And that's a fair ball. Just a solid swing right there. Yeah. Caught it out front and ripped it into the outfield for the base hit. Those always feel great. And now they've got some speed on first, so we'll see if they try to get him into motion. Manaya checks over to first, and he's back. Marsh over at first with one away. Now here is Johan Rojas. Back to right. Dives, and it gets by. Marsh around second, headed for third. Doesn't stop. That's for home. They'll score easily, and they lead by three. Picks himself up at RBI, punch that ball down the opposite field. Adam Adovino getting the call to the mound. Gets an opportunity to square off against his former team, so I wouldn't be surprised if he came out a little extra jacked up right here. So the batting order turns over. So here's the Phillies DH, Kyle Schwarber. And the righty deals. Swing and a miss, and that's strike two. Two two now. And a foul ball, he stays alive. Still only one out here in the inning.
Hard grounder into the outfield for a knock. In comes the runner from third. It's 6-2. Comes through with the RBI. Not much to this one other than just a willingness to go the other way and put the ball in play. That's a team at bat right there. Nice job of staying back and letting the ball get deep. Trey Turner with a chance now. So a foul ball makes it one and two. Man at first one away. Ground ball right side could be two. Quick feed to second for one. On to first, double play. And that's the inning. Welcome back. And a new arm on the mound to start the eighth. Jose Ruiz. And he's got a nice lead to work yeah, with. So you should come in throwing strikes. Attacking these hitters. Oh, the catcher for the Mets, Francisco Alvarez. Kicks and deals. And now the count, one and two after the swing and the miss. Bows it back with two strikes. Here's a one two. And yeah, there's a ball. Bounce to the right side. Stop. First out in the top of the eighth. Francisco Lindor comes up to the plate. The Mets down by four, and we're in the top of the eighth. Swing and a miss. And it's one and two. Good late sink on that fastball. Out of the hand looks so good. And then by the time he gets in the hitting zone, hard to get the barrel to it. Rip to short. Turner with the throw to first. Two up, two down here in the top of the eighth. Two out, space is empty. Here's the second baseman, Mark Vientos. Two down, nobody on. Up the middle, stop. Jump throw, and it's a one, two, three inning. Back now, new pitcher on the mound as we roll into the bottom of the eighth, Phil Maton. The offense will need to be ready for the breaking stuff. He's got a great curveball. Three, four, five, do up for the home team. And now the first baseman, Bryce Harper. Harper. And he deals. Fights that one away, still one and two. A little early on that fastball, I'm sure the pitcher taking a note. Look for an off-speed pitch on this next one. And the right-hander deals. Foul off the plate. They'll do it again. Righty delivers. Stays alive. Five foul balls in a row. I have no idea what that feels like. But you got to love this battle. Just wondering who's going to blink first. No, Just misses. Ball. ball two. The pitch. Three ball. Swung on, bolted. And one, he's gone. A massive home run. And they tack one on the board. It's 7-2. Now it's the right fielder, Nick Castellanos. 
Here comes a pitch. That's out to center field. Nimmo has it sized up. Calls it in for the out. And there's one away. And now for the Phillies, Alec Bull. Third base One down, base is empty. Now drive, base hit. Taking over on the mound for the Mets, Ryan Stanek. Well, they need someone to stop the bleed and keep the score right where it is. Seems like a tough task today with the way this lineup is swinging it. Runner on at first with one gone. Bryson Stock stands in for the Phillies. Next offering is down low. That's a strike across the top of the zone. Okay. Swings through it, and that's a strikeout. Yeah, and at first, yeah, yeah. JT Real Muto, the next to hit. Ball to strike. Oh. And another ball. Two and one. the lead runner at second two on and two out yeah, everything came together for them. that pretty much split the zone down the middle and those are the ones where you got to make them pay Brandon Marsh stands in for the Phillies that missed by a lot and that's ball two right-handed reliever Way inside, gets out of the way. Out towards right center, that's well struck. That one is back. And it's off the out-of-town scoreboard. One run across, now two runs score. And they're pulling away up by seven now. Nicely done, brings home two. Anytime you smoke a ball off the wall, you kind of think about what it could have been, but obviously you have to be happy with that result. Fly ball to right. Taylor moving under it. Hauls it in to end the inning. We're back. It's the top of the ninth, and there's a new pitcher on the mound, Tanner Banks. Compared to some days, this is a pretty low leverage appearance for him, so he should be fairly free and easy out there. Still have to keep yourself sharp and attack the strike zone. Digging in, Brandon Nimmo. Left hand batter waits. Swing and a ball lifted to center field. And there's one down. He's two outs away. Pete Alonso up now for the Mets. Next one misses, and it's two and one. Foul ball there. One down, base is empty. Outside. Swing and a drive, deep right field. Way back there. Pulls it in on the warning track. So, last chance for the Mets. Number 11 up now for the Mets. Plenty of extra carry on that ball to right right there. Almost got out of here thanks to the win. It's whipping right now. On its way to the corner. And that will drop foul. The Mets down to their final strike. Swing and a base hit. 
Joey gets on base and keeps it going. Showed some really nice patience in that at bat. The Worked himself into three. a good count. Showed a willingness to drive that pitch the opposite way. Didn't get jumpy. Didn't try to pull the oh. ball. He let it get deep. Took the barrel right to it and then extended through the swing for the line drive base hit. And another ball. Championship Series.